hair in my. I was gonna go get a haircut today. You're a hairdresser. Yeah. And you're gonna go. Towel. So what does a hairdresser do when she needs a haircut? Uh, go to New York, Bumble and Bumble. That's your spot. Ninety-five bucks. Yeah. Really? That seems cheap. Uh, is that is that? I think it's average. In New York. York City? Yeah, I think it's average there. Really? Yeah. Interesting. I think it's average. I have yeah. to talk to my wife because she like she has me convinced it costs like a, a, a bazillion dollars to get her hair done, and if it was, if it was in New York, I'm it'd be like. Sure. I went on their side. It's like yeah, ninety-one. But the last time I thought it was one twenty-five. I don't know. Bumble, bumble. Bumble and bumble. Bumble yeah. and bumble. That's your joint. That's the joint. And what's your joint's name? Beauty bar. Beauty bar. On, we're going to talk about this a little bit before we get into your artwork. Which, mm -hmm. And Beauty Bar is on Parker Street. Yeah, it's attached to Pratty's. And you say that there's a sign, but I'm convinced that, that the sign is some kind the of optical is, illusion. You can see it. It's on the kind of faces the street, yeah. so it's not dead center. And you do men's and women's haircuts? Yes, coloring, eyebrow shaping. For men? Men do that? Men, yes. Men with unibrows. You have men that come in and have that and done. become sexy. <laughs> I've done a few of those. Yeah. And um, do you do know. waxing? That's the eyebrow wax, but nothing else. Like you eyebrow, don't do the, the, no, no the legs, bikini no or body, anything. No, no Brazilians. No backs. Like that. No backs. No men with hairy backs. No. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna hear back. You want to take care of? Well, no, we're gonna well, have. You're not doing that. Yeah, we're doing it right now. Yeah, well, you know, it's funny. I was gonna, ha I was gonna have this uh, hairless for char charity event, where all the Good Morning Gloucester men were gonna uh, get donations to to film us getting, like, ripped like the hair off our backs ripped off. Oh, that was a good one. <laughs> and raise and have people play. I will participate in that. I could do it. Yeah, you could do that. I could rip it off. All right. Oh, she's a rip. She, she does not mind. <laughs> Yeah. All right. Well, I'm here with Laureen, and and you're the guest artist here at good, the Good Morning Gloucester Con Studio. Right on. How do you like it down here on Rocky Neck? I love it. Um, I used to come for day trips with my daughter and uh, my sister, so it's where I was first inspired. I was walking by the studio with my my sister and my daughter, and I see these amazing paintings. I was stopped in my tracks, and I looked at them, and I'm like, I wonder how much something like that would go. I want one for my apartment. And it was like, yeah, thirty thousand dollars or something. And then I said, I got to start painting because I'm like, <laughs> I do everything myself. So that's how I first got into it. But I waited years to start, and then uh, now I've been painting for nine years. But I still love those are my still my favorite paintings. But I love Patty Sullivan. I love um, Tom Gill. There's just a lot of artists. Patty, Patty Sullivan. Uh, I, her name comes up a lot as uh, as as someone that. You know, her her work is recognized now, but like they say in the future, her work is really going to st uh, stand out. Mm -hmm. and do you feel that way? She has a beautiful one right now. Of um, It looks like the Essex Marsh. And I just love her because she's very simple. Yeah. She simplifies everything, but the colors are great. And, so. where, and where does... She, you, you have kind of an eclectic... Uh, here at the gallery, you have an eclectic mix of things. You have uh, portraits of, of artists, uh, you know, a lot of local mm -hmm. musicians, I see. Fly and, and, and Willie, then Alan Estes, and then you have flowers, and you have uh, and you have harbor scenes, yeah. and, the, and, the, and the classic Good Harbor Beach one that everybody seems to be gra to gravitate to. I know. I, I think it's know. the light in that painting. It's just, mm -hmm. it's really special. Thanks. Yeah, I went to the Hopper show at the MFA, and then when I, I was totally inspired, so I wanted. I thought, what would Hopper do? If he was still alive today, because he used to paint in Gloucester in I think the 30s and 40s, so I just thought that's what he would do. So that's what I did. There you go. Yeah, that show I missed the show, and he's like. He's amazing. He, he had a self-portrait too, and it was yeah, insane. This. Yeah, here's the one we're talking about. Very Hopper-esque. Yeah, kind yeah, of. Yeah, like look at desolate, you. Desolate, lonely, no people. <laughs> yeah. Although he does have people in a lot of his paintings, a lot of women. But um. And this, the flowers were going to be a part of, it. at first it was called Catch of the Day, because that, I got the name from the rum line, they'd always be the chalkboard Catch of the Day, but they'd be the great musicians playing in front of them, and I thought, they're the Catch of the Day. Oh. Not the dinners, you know, but then I changed it to Rock Garden, because I was um, adding some florals in. So I wanted to have, you know, a lot of flowers, but of course I didn't get to it, because <laughs> I'm busy cutting hair for my real job, but... Um, yeah, I wanted to add some florals and I want to do more landscapes in the future. Yeah? Yeah. It's Stuff beautiful. like that, you know. Yeah. Boats. We gotta find my out. first boat this, painting. This is your first boat painting. Yeah. And we want to talk. Fever. This is a shout out to whoever owns the fever. Laureen would like to know who you are. 
So we she... saw the boat at Beacon Marine. It's being worked on, and the name of the painting is Smith's Cove's Got the Fever. So, oh, very cool. Yeah. yeah. The church in there and the city hall. Oh, man. So, but that's my first boat painting. I never thought I would get to that because it's the rigging, you know. My boyfriend's a sailor, so he gets really upset if I don't get, like, the lines right. <laughs> oh, yeah. What are you doing with that? It's tough when you're in, the, if you're, if, I imagine if you're in a town like Gloucester, like, it must be, must be a little bit intimidating, like, to paint, like, boats and stuff it like is. that. It is. It's just so much stuff. Yeah. If you look at this one, like, there's all these little things, but I left out a lot of stuff, but that's what I love about the landscapes and the scenes, because it's just full of stuff. <laughs> yeah. That I don't really know what it's about, but it just looks cool. <laughs> Well, so. you know, I think that's part of the reason why Rocky Neck is, you know, was the, is the oldest uh, working art colony is because there was it, it was also, you know, one of the busiest ports, and um, so there was so much to, to paint, you know, mm -hmm. so people con congregated here. Yeah. So what inspired the, uh, you know, do you, do you are you a huge lover of the Gloucester music scene? Totally. Yeah, I love it. And one day I was sitting there, and it was a long time ago when I first started painting. I didn't know what to paint. I'd go to each site and say, that's too too busy. Then i go to another site, I can't paint water. Another site, there's too much stuff in there. I can't paint people. So I would end up coming all the way up here from Melrose and not painting anything. And then, go, then I started living here, and I said, you know, what would I, if I really could paint, what would I paint? And I just loved the scene so much that I thought, I would love to just capture these guys with their instruments, because I play guitar too, and I'm from a family of guitar players. So, um, I just, I started with um, JB, because he's awesome, I love his smile, <laughs> I love his glasses, he's like Ray Charles, he's just funny as hell. And um, so that's, that was the first one, and it took me like four years to do the next couple, I think I did like, I might have done, yeah, this was first, and then um, probably second, Alan probably was third, you know, and then I kept moving on, and then I got a little bit bigger canvas for Lisa Marie and Rick Brasdan, but um, I just didn't know if I, I didn't think I could ever paint people, but, you know, I just wanted to do it so badly, I'm like, let me just try it. So, for the, was the reason for you to move, you moved to Gloucester six years ago? Yeah. That's right. And what was the what was the reason you moved here? Um, I was moving in with my boyfriend. You followed a man here. I did. And that was the only reason. There wasn't anything else. Uh, had well, you I was been gonna, wait a minute. You been, no, I was gonna. Go, that's right, because we had broken up, and then we got back together. But I was already looking for an apartment. I looked. I knew Paul across the street at the big, huge house. He was living there, mm -hmm. and uh, he was renting out a place. And I thought, I'm gonna get that place. And that way, you know. And I changed careers. I was working at Harvard in the alumni, writing letters two years in a row, taking trains, buses, and planes back and forth every day. Then I went to school for hairdressing because I thought I could do it on the North Shore somewhere. I could get close to here, but I never thought in a million years I'd ever live here. This was like vacation land. Come up for the day, go home. So that's, so that was, so you, you so when you did finally decided to make the leap, you were seeing a guy, but what were the things that you loved about the place? The art, the definitely. Art. The scene, the whole landscape. The water, like it's so peaceful. The mm. beach, you know, yeah. just coming up, and the people are nice. I would always come up, and it took me a long time to like finally like go into a bar and have a drink alone or whatever after painting. And it's like forget it. You go and you meet everybody, and they get you know, they're yeah. friendly up here. Beautiful. Yeah. Well, thanks. Your show. Where's your show run? How, when does her uh, show run till? To the through the twenty second, but it comes down on the twenty second. So okay, in the morning, right? EJ comes down on the. T I think it's in the morning you wanted it to come down. So, so you got another week or so. Yeah, and I'm going to be here Wednesday, um, July twentieth, six to nine for sure. I'm trying to divide my time between beauty bar and here, so I can't yeah. always be here. Will you be here for the mug up? No, you got to come down on the oh, evening, sure. the twenty first, because the new wires goes up the morning, the twenty second. Yeah, so it will be through the day and mug almost the night. Right? Yeah, mug up Sunday if you. Um, There's yeah. a lot of people come for mug up every uh, every Sunday at, at ten o'clock. What we, is it, mug up? Mug we have we have coffee and pastries here, and people bring in like little things, and everybody okay. kind of hangs out and stuff and meets the people. That sounds like fun. So there you go. Come yeah. meet Laureen at mug up. Thank and, you. And what was the other day that you're gonna be here? Wednesday. Uh, I'm thinking Wednesday for sure, but I'm gonna try to come tonight and on the weekend. It's you know, but I just I'm afraid to commit, and then if I tell everybody and then I'm not here, nah. I feel bad. If, I have a friend coming from Ipswich. I have another friend coming from the Cape this weekend. A very popular person. Yeah, well, with Facebook, everybody, oh, hi. <laughs> right, so especially this time of year. She lives on the other Cape, so she wants to come up. 
I haven't seen her in 10 years. She's a graphic designer. The last time she knew me, I was not cutting hair. I was not painting. Oh, wow. So when she saw me, she was like, what are you doing? So she's going to come up. Fantastic. Yeah, she's a nice person. Well, there you go. Thanks so yeah. much, Lauren. It's so great to Thank meet you. you. It's good to finally meet you, too. <laughs>